Live. Mark? I would like to welcome back to the show Marissa. She is the editor in chief with the Toy Insider. Marissa, welcome back. And the first time you're on, we were talking about gifts at different price ranges for the holidays. And today we're talking about different age groups. So again, if you're at home, you're an aunt, uncle, grandparent, or even a parent, listen up and take notes because Marissa always has some great <laughs> things to talk about. And yeah. I find this particularly challenging because if you don't have a kid, like in a particular range, then you have no clue what older kids or let's say younger kids are into. Definitely. I think it's a mistake that people make all the time when buying gifts. You have to pay attention to that age range on the package. It really does mean something. Um, that is really your guiding light to say, this is a good, a good toy for kids in this age because they'll be able to fully appreciate what the toy does. So, you know, sometimes people are like, oh, my kid's really smart. He'll be able to figure out. And it's like, yes, maybe, but it really is intended for a little bit of a younger audience or an older audience. So it's just good to pay attention to. Absolutely. And I feel like your average kid is smarter than they were 20 years ago. So like a five-year-old now is probably where I was when I was 18, <laughs> especially yes, when it comes to technology. <laughs> yeah. The next generation is going to just blow us all away. I know it. <laughs> where would but you yeah. like to start? We'll start with something for all ages, so kids as young as zero. Um, this is called Lola Brights. This is one of my favorite toys of the year, especially in a very stressful year because this is all about um, relaxation and comfort for kids. So you get the super cute soft plush. It's, it's perfect for cuddling, but when you press its paw, it also plays three different lullabies and it gives off some really cool soothing lights. So you can actually give this to kids at bedtime because it does have a timer. So it'll automatically shut off on its own after a few minutes. Um, and it does play those soothing, of those soothing lullabies to, to sort of sing kids to sleep, which is perfect. That is a great gift. <laughs> I love the fact that it has a timer because a lot of times when you don't have that, the parent yeah. has to walk across the house and turn the device off. So that is- Exactly. Great. Yeah, I love this one. And it's just under $15, so a great price point for a gift. All right, now we're moving up a little bit in age, correct? Yes, we are. So we're going to talk about preschoolers. So Diana is a really popular YouTube kid. She has billions of views on YouTube, millions of subscribers, and now she's got her very own toy line coming out. So I'm going to show you the Love Diana Mystery Shopper. When you open up this mystery shopping bag, you get to see um, and reveal your Diana doll. She's in a little salon, and then you've got 15 different surprises to uncover below, including lots of different accessories and things to play with your new Diana doll. Um, but this is a really good one for preschoolers, um, kids in that three plus age range who are obsessed with watching their favorite YouTube stars unbox toys, and now they can kind of bring that to real life in the toy box. And you know, when you talk about ages, that's something, again, a lot of people might not understand that, but younger kids, they watch YouTube more than just regular TV. And that's where yeah. a lot of the inspiration comes from with what they want as far as a gift. So that is a perfect fit with that. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's content on demand, right? They're always looking at those tablets and watching YouTube videos, and now they can bring some of their favorite creators into the real world. And, you know, you talk about content and creation, which brings us really to our third thing, and that is creating yeah. your own content. Yeah, you're exactly right. So this is one of my favorite toys of the year. This one is selling out fast. So you want to get your hands on this if, you, if you're looking for it. But um, it's called the Kitty Zoom Creator Cam. And it's a camera that kids can use. Um, it's safe for kids ages five and up. There's no Bluetooth connection or internet connection or anything like that. So everything stays contained on the camera and in the SD card. Um, but basically, kids can take their own videos. The camera actually flips up so you can do selfie mode to do your own vlogs. It's got a little selfie stick that doubles as a tripod but the really cool thing is that it comes with a green screen so kids can make their own videos and look like they're um, doing their own weather forecast or running from dinosaurs and all of the editing software is built right into the camera too so you don't need anything additional for this that is great and that's one of those things you buy that device for a child and they will have you know, hours upon hours of things to do with it. And they're going to keep on building with their craft of creation. What age is for that? So this one's good for kids ages five and up. I would say between like five and eight is really that sweet spot of the, of the kids who are going to love this. Yeah, again, that is a, a perfect gift. All right, so we're moving up even higher now on the list when it comes to age. 
Yeah. So now we're going to talk about something for kids ages seven and up. So I don't know about you, but I was obsessed with the Queen's Gambit on Netflix. It's like the show that everyone is talking about and it's making chess cool again. So the perfect way to learn how to play chess is with this really great chess set called No Stress Chess. So you can see it comes with this chess board that outlines where you can put all the pieces and how to make your first couple of moves. And then it also comes with cards that teach you how to move each piece and where and when you can do so. So it's a really great way to learn the game of chess. This is um, perfect for kids ages seven and up. But again, like even if you're an adult and you don't know how to play, it's a great teaching tool for you too. And then once you get the basics down, you flip the board over and it's a blank regular chess board. So it really kind of grows with kids too as they learn. You know, what's really interesting is like during this entire pandemic, a lot of people are almost taking a step back when it comes to technology and opening up some old board games and things like that. Well, this is a perfect opportunity to teach the entire family because let's just say you used to know how to play chess. It's a good <laughs> reminder of how to do it. But then also, you know, kids as young as seven, as you mentioned, could start to play. So especially during these times, that's a great gift. Yeah, yeah. Board game sales are through the roof this holiday season because the whole family is just looking for ways to kind of unplug and play together, especially when you're not able to necessarily go as many places as you normally would in a regular year. So um, yeah, No Stress Chess is a, is a great one and that one's available on Amazon. All right. And I think we have one more on the list and this one will be probably for like the older kids, right? <laughs> Yeah, so now we're talking about kids ages about nine and up. So this is a really cool Connect set. It's called Connects Architecture. There are three different ones kids can choose from, Golden Gate Bridge, the London Eye, or the Eiffel Tower. So three really iconic landmarks. Um, you get all the parts and pieces needed to build up the entire set. And then you also get some fun facts about each landmark. So it's a really cool educational experience, but also a fun activity. And again, another one that the whole family can really get in on together because everyone can contribute something and build a piece at a time. Yeah. And then once you're done, obviously creating it, it looks just really cool to display it around your room. Yeah. Such a cool piece of room decor when you're finished. Well, Marissa, thank you so much. You did an awesome job and you must really have like a lot of space all around you because you keep pulling toys from out of thin air. I'm constantly surrounded by toys. It's how I live my life. Well, you have a very <laughs> cool job and you are great at what you do. Now, if people want to learn more about the Toy Insider, how can they do that? Yeah, you can come check us out and check out our full holiday gift guide online at thetoyinsider.com. Thanks again. We appreciate it. Yeah, thanks for having me. When there's hope. When you soar. When you help. There's only one news team you can count on to cover the stories that lift you up. Anchors and reporters who put you first, making it worth your time to watch every day. When you want a news team who understands why local is what matters most, watch News 